Okay, we're going to look at today how to create a realistic ribbon on a piece of paper. Now this technique, you do need tonal paper, either greys or browns, but I'm going to show you first of all how to do the technique using white paper, just so you can see the marks clearly. You need two pencils, ideally if you can hold them with about an inch in between, that's great. If you're really struggling to, to hold them in that position, one thing you can do is we can actually tape uh, the pencils together. So let me know if you're struggling with that. Okay, have a nice gap between the two pencil tips and we're going to just start with one loop on the paper. Now at first it's really confusing because you've got lines everywhere and what we need to do is clean up the drawing. So we're going to imagine that this is the flat ribbon coming up, under and then over the top. So we need to show that. Where you have a cross, you've got a little bit of work to do. We are going to draw a line to make the triangle there and the same on this side. That then, hopefully you can see that curve a little bit more clearly. We need to rub out one of these lines. So we're going to imagine that this is the front of the ribbon and this is the inside. So we need to get rid of that line there. So if it rubs the other ones out a little bit, just kind of pop them back in. Okay, so the ribbon comes up, around and down. So again, we've got some more rubbing out. We're going to rub out that line. And because I want the ribbon to come over the top, I'm going to rub out these lines too. So we've got to clean up the drawing so we get that lovely realistic look of the, uh, the ribbons curving and overlapping. So hopefully now you can see that curve a little bit more clearly. That's the most difficult part, is just figuring out which part of the ribbon is coming up, which bit is overlapping the other. So that's the starting point. 